You've probably seen a lot of those shows. Mentalists, magicians, illusionists. You'd be shocked to know that sometimes, not often, but sometimes, it's the real deal. Masquerading as an act. Hiding behind a few $50 tricks. Hiding in plain sight. Because if the magician doesn't do that, the alternative is impossible for others to live with. Anyway, Wednesday night at the back page doesn't pay very well, so I gamble. But I don't play against other people, only against the house. So, no mega jackpots, no long shots. The idea is to go unnoticed. That way I can keep coming back. I'm not a god. I can't see everyone's future, only my own, and only within two minutes, except for when I saw her. But we'll come back to that. There's no pattern to this guy. He's all over the map. Oh, he's not counting, not off the top of a five-deck shoe. Wait a minute. Isn't it that two-bit magic act over at the back page? What's his name? Cadillac. Yeah, it's Frank Cadillac. Is he pulling tricks on us? Is that legal? You can't trick the deck. I'm telling you, that little prick knows what's coming. If he's running that good a system, why is he not betting more? That's going to be my second question. Look at that. He's looking right at us. It's, it's like he can hear us. What table was that? 27. This is Robert Bow. Give me 10 minutes. Table 27 coming right down. Place your bets, please. Here's the thing about the future. Every time you look at it, it changes because you looked at it. And that changes everything else.